In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to upgrade the Golden Shank to the Spork Knife on the Black Ops 4 Zombies map Blood of the Dead. Now, to do this, you will first obviously need the Golden Shank. If you don't already know how to get that, you can find a link to my quick guide in the description. Now, in that guide, I say you have to get about 100 Golden Spork kills around that tub in the New Industries building. That is actually incorrect, you do not need to be near the tub. In this gameplay, I was just outside the powerhouse when I got the completion sound. And as you can see, the tub then changed to blood. Huge thanks to Coaster Maniac and Mikey Myers for confirming this. So after you pick up your golden shank from the press machine, go back to the tub of blood and interact with it. When you do, the skeleton hand will rise and take away your shank. Now, if you make your way to the middle of the catwalk near the water tower, you'll see a knife and Sal DeLuca's prison number stuck to this sign. What you have to do is kill a warden with your knife near this sign. What I would recommend doing is saving a zombie at the end of the round and then spawning in a warden with the citadel number pad. After that, bring him over to the catwalk. Now I think the easiest way to do this is by shooting the warden until you knock off his helmet. You could even shoot him once or twice after that if you wanted, but just be sure not to kill him yet. Once you've brought him near the sign, simply lunge knife him until he dies. If you have ethereal razor in your modifier slot, you should only have to knife him about five times. When he dies, Sal's prison number will fall down to the ground like so. Now all you have to do is return to the tub and interact with it to get the spork knife. This melee weapon seems to be an infinite one hit kill whether it's a swipe or lunge. You can even one hit kill wardens. Well that's pretty much it for this video. So so thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.